So we're gonna go for a bushwalk, me and the boy. He's got his haversack on. You got a lot of gear in there? Yeah. Got his knife, his paracord, his poncho, um, I don't know, fire kit. So it's actually quite comfy weather, it's about 20 degrees. 15 to 20 degrees less than what it was yesterday and the day before. So well, we decided to go for a bushwalk and uh Nah, not that way. Go for a bushwalk, go to our favourite spot. The boy's gotta learn. The boy's gotta learn. It's quite nice when it's uh Nah, look at this shit. What? Red Rooster, Kentucky, what is it? Uh, Maccas, someone's been walking through here in Maccas and shit. Ass wipes. Alright, so we arrived at a little favourite spot. It's just a, oh, it's just a little flat kind of spot here. Pretty much a big rock with a uh, scrub growing over it but we like it so yeah all right so i'm out here today with my 511 rush 12 pack i pretty much um took a lot of stuff out of it it was just too friggin heavy for like a day trip and even just a hike so show the knife i've given you yeah. that's his knife i've given it to him today i don't know what brand it is but it's a pretty decent knife pretty sharp so that's the knife he's going to carry and hopefully show when he's my age one day. So I'm using the 511 Rush 12 pack today and uh, it's going to be my preferred day hike bag I think. Um, I've taken a lot of stuff out of it to make it light and I'm pretty happy with the gear that's inside it so I may do a review later on and show you what's in there. Alright, the other day I bought this, uh, this aluminium a uh, little kettle, tea kettle I guess, uh, very light, and uh, going to give it a go, um, huh. boiling up some water and making some soup, so um, yeah, I'll get to it. Alright, I was going to um, boil some water up, but my alcohol stove, an actual stove is in there, and I forgot to bring the metho, <coughs> the actual fuel for it. I could use wood, but uh, I don't know, I mean it's cold, but... We do have uh, extreme fire dangers and uh, always practicing how to use the compass. <clears throat> Which way is north? Sounds about right. No, if north if north is that way, then south is this way, opposite me. Alrighty, so I'll just quickly show you what's in my 511 Ross 12 bag. It doesn't weigh a lot. I don't know, I reckon 5 kilo. Not even. Firstly, on the outside I've got my drop pouch. And I've got my little fishing kit here. Just always bring a fishing kit. Got a uh, S-Beaner there. So in the first front pocket, it's got some uh, satchels, courier satchel, and some uh, Ziploc bags, snake bite wraps, I've got two of them in there. Spare batteries. For my torch. Just a mirror, it's my wife's uh, makeup mirror. Does the job. Um, sharpening system, being a Smith sharpening uh, system there. <clears throat> Got a spare fold out knife, being the buck. I uh, don't know what model buck it is, but yeah, it's a real sharp blade. Uh, just a repair kit, some. Uh, 
steel wire, um, duct tape, needles and thread, all that kind of stuff. Just a uh, camping towel. <clears throat> That's pretty much it. It's going nice and light and easy. Don't need too much for a day trip or a hike. Uh, in this pocket here, I've just got some medical stuff, so electrical tape, eye wash, painkillers, I've got emergency lighter, lip balm, poncho, band-aids, wound wipes, burn gel, just basic medical stuff. In this zipper here, I've got my uh, fire, ferro rod, fire striker, I love this one, um, just a backup solar. <coughs> torch and a compass. All fits there nicely. Actually, sorry, and in the front pocket here, I've got just a, uh, a torch here. At the back, where the water bladder is supposed to be. Uh, pretty much just got a poncho, a uh, good quality poncho, and my windbreaker for my alcohol stove, on the stove. And obviously this poncho doubles up as a, uh, as a shelter. In the main compartment, Just in here, I've got a bit of a brew kit, so just some sugar, tea, some lollies, a uh, spoon and fork, spork. Um, here I've got my collapsible mug, and I've got some rain, rain pants there. In the main section, I've got some cordage, I've got my bandana, I've got some zip ties, I've got some more kind of just food, the boy already ate the cheese and crackers, I've got some protein, I've got a protein bar, an oat slice, some soup, some lollies and more tea. In this sock I've got my alcohol stove uh, with the actual stove there. Uh, I've got my buck knife, which should be on my person but because I'm in a suburban area I'm not going to carry it, but the buck vanguard is in my bag. Um, chopsticks, just because. My uh, kettle. Can't find a lid, there it is. Good old kettle. And a uh, beanie. And you know what? That is pretty much it. So I'm going pretty basic. It's only a day, day hike bag. Um, the water bottle, I just put a plastic water bottle, but uh, generally my GI canteen would be in here with a litre of water. Um, that's it. So if I was going out from 6am to 6pm, I'd carry more water and food. Um, if I'm just going for an hour, like I am now, you know, that's more than enough gear in here to, uh, to make me feel comfortable. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. That is my day hike gear. So, um, yeah, and I, you know, I've got these little barley sugars here, little lollies. The boys already munched on one. Yeah, it's a good, good source of uh, sugar for him and uh, keeps the saliva in his mouth. Um, I didn't bring a lot of water, probably half a bottle of water. We're going to head off now anyway. Um, I'm probably a bit thirsty anyway. So, that's it, people. So, that's my kind of new day hike bag I've taken a lot of stuff out of here to make it light and um, yeah and I mean lesson learnt I forgot to bring my metho metho spirits from my alcohol stove I should have kept a couple of Esbit uh, cubes in my bag for backup so lesson learnt there uh, when I get back home I'll be uh, putting in putting in probably about six Esbit cubes in there just for backup for fire um, 
So yeah, but uh, work in progress. I want to try to go as light as I can and um, just not go too too heavy. I just don't want to be doing this shit too heavy. So anyway, cheers.